treatments. So here we are going to discuss about the topic called the statements and its introduction. So here in its introduction we are going to discuss about the statements. Say so here statements or in other words a statement is nothing but a sentence which is either true or false but not the both. So such a sentence is said to be called as a statement and as well as along with this statement we are going to discuss about the negation of the statement. So here the negation of the statement is nothing but the if a statement is of P then its negation will be of not P. So here we will discuss in detail about the negation and as well as the statements. Then now so regarding the statement a sentence which is either true or false but not both is called a statement. Then now here let us perform few illustrations of the statements. So here the illustrations are of. So I am going to consider the statements by means of the letters say P, Q and R. Say here the first statement is of 2 plus 2 is equals to 6 whereas here on the LHS it is of 2 plus 2 but it is value is of 4 and the right hand side quantity is of 6 but they are not equal therefore the statement is of a false statement. So here this sentence 2 plus 2 equals to 6 is a sentence but its truth value is of false. So here therefore the statement that is P is a false statement. Then now the second statement. She is very talented. So here the sentence is she is very talented, but here it is not a statement because it needs say here this statements this sentence needs further information to be a false statement or a true statement. Therefore, Q is not a statement. So here the sentence given is not a complete statement because it needs further information to be a true statement or a false statements. So here hence Q is not a statement simply it is nothing but only a sentence that is she is very talented and now regarding the truth values truth values of a statement. Here the truth value of a statement is nothing but the truthness or the falsity of a statement is said to be called as a truth value of that particular statement. The truthness and falsity of a statement is called the truth value of the statement. Then now here let us perform the few illustrations under this. So here the illustration number 1 is of. Let us consider A, B and C as the 3 statements. So first one is of all primes are odd numbers. And the second one as 7 plus 5 is equals to 12 
and the third statement as all natural numbers are positive so here plus v indicates the positive then now the statement the truth value of the first statement so here the truth value of statement that is a implies so here all primes are odd numbers whereas here the prime numbers are of the least prime number is of 2 but it is an even number so here 2 3 5 7 are the prime numbers whereas here 2 is a even number therefore the truth value of that particular statement is a false one so here the reason is since 2 is even it is an even prime so here based upon this reason so here the truth value of the statement that is a is of a false then now regarding the b 7 plus 5 equals to 12 say on the left hand side 7 plus 5 so both are of positive we can add up plus of plus is plus plus 7 plus 5 is of 12 on the left hand side right hand side is also of 12 therefore it is a true statement therefore the truth the truth value of the second statement that is b is of true truth value of statement of b so implies it is true because the reason is 12 is equals to 12 lhs is equals to rhs so here since 12 7 plus 5 is of 12 on the lhs and the rhs is also of 12 that is lhs and rhs are equal therefore the statement is true statement therefore the truth value is also of true that is we can denote by means of truth value true by means of the calculator t whereas here the truth value of a is of false we can denote by means of the calculator that is f and whereas this third statement is of c whereas the sentence is of all natural numbers are positive numbers so here the natural numbers the least natural number is of 1 then 1 2 3 4 and dash dash are the natural numbers therefore all are of positive numbers therefore the c is a true statement so here the truth value of statement that is c is of true we can denote by means of capital T because here all are of positive since natural numbers each and every natural number is a positive number so here natural numbers are of the positive one then now the second one the second topic is about the negation of a statement So here the negation of a statement when we consider one statement as p then its negation of the negation of the statement that is p can be written by means of stating a word that is not before the p let p be any statement then the negation of statement that is p is obtained or got by writing so here by writing not in front of or in before p so we will be getting the negation of p so here it is denoted by means of by the symbol so here it is denoted by the symbol negation of p and it is read as not p then now so here let us perform one tabular form in which the truth values are the truth table of this negation the connective called the negation then now in the next logical step so here it is the negation truth table so in this negation truth table so we are going to consider a statement let us consider the statement as p then its negation will be of negation p then now here a statement has two possibilities so it may be either true or false therefore the truth values of the statement that is p are of true or false there are of only two possibilities for a one statement if there are of two statements there are of four possibilities if there are of three statements there will be of eight possibilities 
So here I took only one statement by means of P. Therefore, there will be of two possibilities. One is of true, the other is of false. Then the negation of that particular statement that is P, the negation P will be of. If the statement is of true, then we have to attach not in front of that negation P. Therefore, if it is of true, then the negation will be of not true. That means it will be of false. Then the next statement is of false, then the negation will be of. If the statement, the given statement is of false, then the negation will be of not false. That is, if it is of not false, then automatically it will be of true. Then therefore, so your statement if it is of true, then the negation will be of false. And if the statement if it is of false, then the negation will be of true. So in this manner, so this is the truth table of the negation of a statement that is P.